as you can see, I have 481 and 700 or 7,679. All right, so. That's the first thing you gotta do is jot down your number. You have to have Adam and Cash if you want to mod both of them. If you don't, then if you just want to mod Cash, then you have to have Cash. But you can't have zero, or you can't not not have it. So I'm gonna save it, or I already saved it, but that's that's mine right there. So I save that. So now I'm just gonna transfer it to my computer real quick. All right, I'll see you then. All right. So now, first thing you gotta do is uh, get your save off your hard drive from your computer. If you don't know how to do that, go to my previous videos that I have. They explain it pretty decently good. So I, I get I found mine it's right here. Here's my last save that we're doing. It has the four, 481 cash, 4,000 or 7,000 something atom. All right. So as you can see, it's on my desktop. That's where I extracted it. At. All right. So the next thing you want to do is you want to make a folder. All right. This is my folder actually, but uh, make a folder. And make sure it has no spaces and it doesn't matter really what you call it, so I'm just gonna say the DAT because just just because you'll you'll understand. So make that on your desktop. Alright, this is where people are having tr trouble with because they're like um they they get problems later on. So just make that. Next thing you do is you're gonna have to get the package file out of this uh this save. Alright, so that how to do that is you need a a program that gets the package file that you can find it so Mario is the one I use I drag and drop my save in Mario file contents main save .bsg. right click extract file I'm just going to extract to the desktop you don't have to rename anything as you can see mine's right right there alright so I'm just going to move it right by my save right there Alright, so the next thing you're going to do is you're going to have to open offzip, pack zip, package zip, sorry. Okay, all these files are on my previous video, so just go there and um, download them. So open offzip, pack zip, UI. It doesn't work on 64-bit, I've been informed, no matter what. So you have to do the command prompt. If you need the commands for it, just ask me. Alright, so next, open your main save.bsg file in the input in the offset tab off zip tab alright so input it's on my desktop the main save dot bsg the output will be the dot the dat file the the folder that you created how about that so as you can see the dat alright so that's the folder i created whatever you created it's on your desktop alright leave these just the same i'm just gonna say this start as you can see uh... well you couldn't really see it but it extracted all the it decompressed it alright so these are all your files the next thing you're gonna have to do is look for the f the, the dot dat file with five zeros alright the way I do this is I search it you know five five zeros but uh... you can manually look through it if you have like a different operating system it takes a while I guess but just find the five zeros as you can see found the five zeros right click open file location right there alright so what I'm gonna do after that is I'm gonna open this in a hex editor alright so the hex editor that somebody wanted me to use was HXD alright so I'm just gonna use that you can use any hex editor it's the same concept for everyone there is the exact same alright so here it goes just drag this in HXD whatever alright so all this hex code alright the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna find your atom and your money. All right. The way you do this is you need a hex or dex to hex or yeah dex to hex converter. I just use the one that came with Hex Workshop. It's called Base Converter. Um, but you can find them online. Just Google um, dex to hex converter. Basically. I gotta look for the file real quick. Staying that a bitch. There it is. B convert. Yeah. So this is the base converter I use. You can go to Google and just type in hex to dex converter, or actually dex to hex converter. Sorry. So um, remember the ones that we noted earlier the well, mine that I noted this is my cache this is my atom alright so I'm just gonna copy this 
and I'm going to put this in the decimal uh, text box. As you can see, this is the hex format of the deck, the decimal. All right, so I just copied the hex version of this, copied it, and I'm going to Control F to find hex values because that's what we're trying to find and paste. And as you can see, it found it found your atom, or sorry, actually that was your cache. My bad. So it found my cache. So the next thing, I'm going to make my cache as max as it can go. You can't get infinite, but you can get that. So pretty much, you replace this, what's highlighted right here, with what's highlighted right here. So it will. That's whatever you want to change it. So here it goes. I'm going to change mine to zero zero. Oh shoot. So that's what it was right there, zero zero. So zero three e seven, zero three e seven. All right. So I just changed my cash amount. That was easy. All right. So next thing is to go to the atom. All right. As mine was seven hundred, so w this number, whatever. I'm going to convert that to hex. A decimal. You do this via online or through base converter, like I have. Copy this value, just the same process again. Control F, paste, find hex value. Okay, I found it. So let's convert the number that we want it to be. Um, so I want 900 max, pretty much max. Yeah, that's best you can do. So zero. Two seven zero F. Two seven zero F. You you won't ever change these the front two uh, zero pair of zeros. All right, just F Y. Kick them out of there. So that's all. You're done with that. That's easy. You just pretty much m modded your whatever. You modded your stuff. So now Control Save or Control S. Sorry, save. So it saved. Exit out of this. You don't need this anymore. You definitely don't need this anymore. So as you can see, you see this file. All right, that's the one you modded. It's still there. Everything's the same besides what you changed. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna need to input this file back into the package. The way you do that is pack zip, which is the another the other tab of offset package pack zip UI. All right. So what you're gonna do is you go the source. The source is gonna be the 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 file that you edited so mine was the five zeros and four 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 so that's in the dot dot the dot <laughs> the dat file wow that sounds really weird but that's what's in so I'm gonna find it real quick so I can see it made a backup file too by the way so you don't have to worry about that that's just in case you mess up or something but here that this is the file that I want that's the file that I modded hex edited all right so as you can see, that's the source. The target is your main save dot package. All right, and mine's on the desktop. So our BSG, not package. Why? Well, it's the package file, but the main save dot BSG. All right, so that's your target. And the the offset. This is going to be this number right up here. It's going to be that number right up there. All right. But here's what you're going to have to do: put a zero, x little like a little X and then paste the file name this this right here your number all right paste your number right there that's you you're pretty much putting it back in the file at the right offset so just do that and you'll be okay so as you can see start everything's all good everything's done all right next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna have to re-put the package back into the save the way you do this is Modio or a thing where you can inject packages or container files. I don't know why I keep saying packages. Alright, so right here, I still have it open. Replace file. Alright, so I'm going to replace the main save.bsg with the one that I newly modded. I just passed it to. There it is. Alright. So I, it just, I just now replaced it and that's that's about you have to rehash resign after that